All right, so your character, you play the brother of Kelly Who, so tell us a little bit about the character of your role in Almost Perfect. I'm kind of the lost soul, um, the drifter. I'm kind of in my own world. I'm not really, really, really part of the family. Not many people of the family know who I am, so I'm kind of like the dark horse, but I'm all, I also consider myself the glue, which is why I, I, when I read the script, uh, I felt like, you know, it was an important uh, character and an important element of the story, which is uh, something that I like to do is something like a challenge for me, so, you know, it worked out. How did you get into the role? Because your character kind of disappears. Kelly has to sort of look after him. What inspired you for the role? What were some of the things you did to get prepared for it? Um, you know, you know, I, I'm a method actor, so I just kind of looked into uh, my, my childhood and, you know, when uh, I had certain feelings that my character did. And quite honestly, um, when we filmed, I tried to stay away from the crew off of set as, as much as possible so that when I was on set, I still felt like a, an outsider. It was, it was just for my, but I, I mean, I love every part, every member of the crew. And towards the end, we started chilling out more and spending more time. So it, 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 in the end, it, like I had not that many scenes. So at the end of the shoot, so. It was good. It was good. Hey, you've been in a lot of different films. What makes this movie different than some of the other stuff you did, and why are you proud of this work? Um, you know, first of all, I, it, it's in English. Uh, you know, my agent seemed to tell me that that when I act in English, it's it's worse than my Cantonese. But it's funny because English is my like mother tongue. So uh, I try to you know give him some footage to see that you know that's not true, <laughs> and kind of put myself to the test as well. And. You know, working with Bertha and Kelly uh, is, has been really great. I mean, uh, working with Tina and Roger, I've learned a lot of acting kind of, you know, tips and stuff. So um, I walked away a better person, a stronger person. So I'm happy about the film. And then lastly, we're here at the premiere. What do you think of all these people coming out to support the film, to support you? I think it's great. I mean, I, I don't do much in uh, Los Angeles, so uh, I don't really get to see these people much. So, you know, I'm really happy to see them out. And uh, hopefully, you know, there'll be more chances for us to chill. You know, Maybe like music out here and you could come out here and do something. Yeah, well, uh, I'm going to start my tour at the, end, at the beginning of next year, so hopefully um, we can get a stop somewhere around here and everyone can uh, have fun with me. All right, lastly, can you say thank you to all your fans for supporting you through everything? Yeah, thank you uh, to all of you who support me and support the cause, because without you guys, I wouldn't still be standing here. So thank you. Hi, Madison Chen, and thank you so much for watching Almost Perfect. <laughs>